Assalamu alaikum guys, in this video we learn how to customize the aggregation code. In a previous video I explained how to get calculation and aggregation for relationship. For example, for this user ID number one that I authenticated, I can say load count to count the relationship rows. So for example, I will say count posts. So if I back and check here, I will find the posts count here is 20, which comes from post table and all posts here belongs to user ID number one. So for example, imagine you want to calculate only the published post or published ad is not null in our case, right? So how can we do that? It's super easy. We will convert the aggregation here to an array and the value will be closure function query. And we can say query where not null published ad. So if I back and check, refresh again, instead of 20, we will see 17. Because as we can see here, three was unpublished, right? By the way, it works for all other aggregation methods. So we can say, for example, load sum. If I check again, it's there is error because, because sum needs a column that will count. So as a second parameter, I will say, for example, like count total so if i back and check we can see here about 8000 and if i remove the query it will be changed to include all hosts first query how to customize aggregation query in laravel if you find it useful support me by clicking on lecture and subscribe see you next video